Hi, I'm Kinkas and I'm a Synth DIY guy. Today we continue our series on easy beginner modules, building the music theme modular Graphic EQ. Just like the startup, the Graphic EQ also comes with all of the SMD circuitry pre-soldered, so you only need to solder on the jacks and the faders. With this simple but useful module, you get 7 fixed bands of EQ, which you can use at the end of your chain to fine-tune your sound before it hits the venue speakers. I also like to use it after my instrument interface to shape my instrument or microphone sound before it hits the modular. In the baggie, you get the pre-soldered SMD circuit board, a high-quality aluminum panel, power cable and mounting screws, as well as all of the faders and both jacks. Building it is super simple. Snap on all of the sliders and jacks, place the panel, tighten the nuts in the two screws that hold the middle fader, and turn it all around to solder. That's it, just check the power header for shorts and plug it into test. Let's hear how it sounds. Okay, so let's check out the graphic EQ in action. First, I'm going to send it some white noise and we're going to hear those bands as I sweep them. So that's my flat white noise from the Erica Synths modulator, my favorite white noise. Let's bring all the frequencies down. And there's a centered detent, so it's very easy to make them flat again. Now I'm going to plug this microphone into my Bifaco instrument interface. And we're going to listen to my voice as I EQ it with this thing. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, 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 hello. La 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 la. Here's a little bit of brightness on my voice, and I can cut off some of those lows if I want to. Here's where the poofs would be. Here I can make it a little more like telephone and uh, cool. So I really like to use this module for this function to condition and prepare. Uh, any audio that I'd want to insert from the real world into the modular system. Now let's plug in a bass. Here it is, my precision bass. So let's scoop out some of those mids and emphasize the lows. distorting a little bit. Bring it down here. And finally, I'm going to make a quick voice quick subtractive voice here. So I'm going to take the sequence, quantize it, send it to a VCO, send the VCO square wave to a filter, send the filter to a VCA, take the gate from the sequencer, trigger an envelope, send the envelope to the VCA, the VCA to the graphic EQ, and now we'll play around.
So that's another use for this graphic EQ. It could be the end of your monophonic voice chain, and you can sort of just tune that voice to sound good in the venue you're in, or prep it for recording. So it's just super nice to have a seven band graphic EQ in your system. That's it for now. I hope you liked the video. If you did, hit like, subscribe, join my Patreon, you know, all that stuff. And see you soon and stay noisy.